Hi, it's Bo Pilgrim here at Bono Insurance, Reed Insurance, talking today about buying insurance online. You know, what are the advantages? What are the disadvantages? What are some tips that I can give you about doing that? So I'm going to break that down a little bit for you and just kind of uh, help you think through that a little bit. So some of the advantages are, well, it's reduced pressure. You know, I don't really like to talk to people. I want to text. I want to fill out something and just get a price. Well, that's something you can do. If you really don't want to talk to someone, you can go there. There's a reduced amount of pressure. Another thing is convenience of shopping, right? You can do it whenever you want to uh, from the recliner at your house while you're watching whatever TV show or while you're in the bed trying to trying to go to sleep, staring at your cell phone. You know, whatever it is, you know, it is convenient, right? Another thing is going to be convenient purchase experience. Like you can, since you're, while you're doing it there from the comfort of your chair at home or whatever, during a lunch break, you know, you can simply buy it there while you're doing that, right? That's some of the advantages of it. Well, those sound great, but what are some of the disadvantages? What am I missing out by doing that? Well, one of them is potential gaps in your policy. You know, because you're going through this internet experience, you know, you're, you are potentially leaving yourself wide open. Look, here's the reality is insurance is incredibly complicated. Look, I've been in the insurance business for 29 years. I've gone through several different insurance schools trying to understand it and to be able to educate people about it. I promise you, just reading an article that's a thousand words long, you have not learned enough about insurance to be able to make a good informed decision. Now, I'm not saying anything about your intelligence. What I am saying is, is very complicated and you need to find a professional that can help you and that can understand what your needs are and then explain that to you. Uh, the second thing is going to be an inaccurate quote. Look, it's the rating process is just not that simple. You can't just say, well, I got this car, I'm this old, here's my rate. That's just not the case. It just, it, it's a lot more complicated than that. There's a lot of questions that we need to ask and a lot of information we need to input to find out what your correct rate is. Um, if you enter that, you know, if when you enter information in, it's probably going to come back and not give you an accurate quote. Uh, I'm willing to bet you 75% of the time that number that they spit out is just not going to be right. When eventually, you're going to have to talk to a live person to get a, a formalized number, and then that number is going to change, unfortunately. Another thing is that uh, you're you know not confident in what you're buying. Like you're guessing you're buying the right thing, or you're assuming you're buying the right thing. Whereas if you're working with a professional, an insurance agent that you can check and see that they got good reviews, then you can know you're buying with confidence. You can feel good about the thing that you're buying. That's, you know, for Reed Insurance, that's one of our four competencies or our four promises that we make to you is that we want to make sure you understand what you're buying so that you feel good about that purchase. You need to understand you're spending a lot of money on this, easily a thousand plus dollars every year you deserve to understand what you're buying and to feel good about that purchase. Another thing is that you don't have an agent to contact. You know, if you have some sort of a claim problem, a billing question or something like that, who are you going to call? There's nobody there. You can call somebody in a cubicle that doesn't even know who you are. They don't care. They're not, why would they care about you versus someone else? They're not going to take the proper time, you know, to, to take care of you like an independent agent is that, knows you, sold you the policy, explained it to you, and is there for you where you're servicing, that you've got their direct number for, their email address, probably able to text with them. You know, you lose that. You lose that expertise. Um, can an independent insurance agent make the, the, uh, the process pain-free? Yes. They don't have to ask you a thousand questions to figure out what it is, but there are certain questions they need to ask. The only reason they're doing that is because they want, they want to make sure they get you the best insurance company for the best rate. They want to make sure that they're applying all the discounts that you deserve. And three, they want to make sure you understand what you're buying. You know, by not having that and having that convenience, you may miss out on that. But really, they're not, not going to make it overly complicated. A lot of insurance companies like us, we have a web form you can go Fill in some information, and then we can either email, text, or call you, whatever you prefer, to fill in the rest of the information on your timetable so we can make it easy for you. Um, fast quotes, turnaround times, less than two days. You know, most insurance agents can do that. Many of them can do it a lot faster than that, you know, typically within a half a day. 
Um, you know, we strive at our agency to try to do that, to have that quote back to you within half a day. Now, obviously, everybody gets busy sometimes, right? You know, like Mondays are crazy busy typically for most agents, but, you know, they may have to push it back a little bit. But typically, you know, they should be able to get back to you. You know, if you talk to the agent and you ask them, hey, when, when will you better get back to me? If they can't tell you a time, they can't tell you, well, I'll get back to you this afternoon or in the morning. You know, they say, well, I'll get back to you whenever I get it completed. Well, maybe you need to just look for the next agent, right? Well, anyway, these are some different things that may help you to understand the differences between the advantages and the disadvantages. At the, at the end of the day, my advice to you is you deserve better. Talk to an independent agent. Let them help you to make sure that you're buying the right coverage for you. Because if you end up with a claim that's not covered, it's going to cost you a lot of money and you don't need that sort of heartache in your life. Hey, this is Bo Pilgrim, Bo Nose Insurance, Reed Insurance. I thank you for watching this video. Hey, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so yet. That way we know that you like what we're doing and that we're helping you to understand what, you know, what your insurance needs are. Uh, this is Bo Nose Insurance, Reed Insurance. Thanks for checking us out. Hope you have a great day.